Hi Jurassic Cuties, Wayne here. Today we're going to draw JJ from Coco Melon. So let's get started. To draw this cute boy, let's first start by drawing his eyes. So I'm going to come right here and draw a big curve. Comes up and down. And we just want to end about the same level. Then from there, let's round off this corner a little bit. And then we're just going to connect it with a soft curve. From there, let's come right across and do the same thing. So I'll come right across using this as my thigh. Come right across, say about right here. And I'll draw the same thing. So go up. And I'll just drag this point across. So approximately you know how high to go up on the other side. And come back down to the same level. And connect with a soft curve. There. Then um, let's come in here and put in the eyes. So I'm going to come to the corner right here and draw a big circle. So see about right here. Just put in this really big curve. And same thing over here. So about right here, nice and big. into this area. From there, I'm going to make them trust so cute eyes. But if you don't want to, you can just put in some highlights. So I'll come in right here with two small circles. Since I have enough space, I'll make them draw so cute eyes. And I'll come to the bottom right here and just put in a little curve. And shade this all in. And lines at the bottom. So same thing over here. There. Okay, so I have these eyes and now let's come between the eyes and about in the center area right here. I'm just going to draw a soft little curve for the nose. And smile, of course. So right underneath this nose, about right here, let's draw a nice big curve and cap it off. There. Okay, so then from there, you know what? Let's make this a tiny bit bigger. Just fill in that space right there. Okay. So then from there, let's come to the top and we're going to draw his brow. So come to where the eye is on this edge, say about right here. I'll go ahead and just draw a slight curve slanting down. And then I'll thicken it up. And same thing over here. So about right here. Curve and down. And thicken it up there okay so then from there um let's see we can come and start to draw the face so come to where the eyes are let's see right here since this is closest i'll come out a little bit just a little bit and same thing right here and from there i'm going to start to draw a curve and a curve so we're just basically drawing a bottom of a u and right here i'm going to go ahead and connect it the curve at the bottom. There. Nice brown curve. And then from there, let's bring this up. And so as I go up, I'm just going to give it a slight angle. Just a slight one. Slightly angles out a little bit. There. And then let's come to where the eyes are in about this area. I would draw some ears. So nice big curve. And let's come in here with some details. Two curves. So same thing over here. So about right here. Now that we have the ears in, let's go ahead and draw the top of the head. So I'm going to come and bring this up nice and round. Uh, drag a point across. Since I'm drawing pretty big, I'll draw the same right here. 
decipher since it's easier for my hand to come down. Okay, so in this area right here, because I there's a tuft of uh, hair right here, right? So I'll stop, um, but if you're using a pencil, go ahead and just finish this curve first. So I'll say about right here, nicely in the center. Imagine this is coming out, so say about right here. Start with a curve, and I'll bring it around. And round this part off. So this is the shape, so like that, nice and round. And then right here, we're gonna come in, bring in another curve, and connect there. <laughs> so it's just a swirl, right? Okay, so then now we can go ahead and finish the head. So about right here. And just imagine it coming through. So go ahead and finish this side. There. Okay, so we have uh, JJ's head in. Now let's draw his body. So right underneath, I'm going to start with a curve for a collar. And then say about right here, shoulders. And I'll just come right here. Um, Simplify it. I'm just going to bring in an angle line. So let's bring this down a little bit more. And about right there, go ahead and just cut it off and connect it with a curve. Then uh, let's draw the pants. So I'll come down a little bit ways and say about right here. Just draw right there an angle line right in the center. And two angle lines that pop out from there. Then let's come to the side. So we're just going to draw a slight angle. Same thing on this side. And connect. And now his legs. So right here, we're just going to angle it, getting thinner as we come down and connect once again. And so let's draw a shoe, comes out, round it off. And connect. And for some details, right here, curve, a top curve, and then this little strap that he has right here. I will just put some dots. <laughs> I think that's how it is. Okay, so then from there, let's do the same thing on this side. And curve. And once again, just pop out the shoe. Make sure it's the same level. And curve. Okay, so we have JJ's shoes in. Now let's draw his arms. So I'll bring this down. We don't want his arms too long because he is a baby, kind of, right? <laughs> so about right here. Just going to cut it off and let's draw this arm first. So I'm going to come out. And I'm just aiming to end about right here. So thumb. And follow our curve. About right here. Connect. So same thing on the other side. So I'll just drag this point across right there. Cut off the sleeve area and then once again same thing. So we're ending about right here. Thumb. Follow. And connect. Okay, so then some for some details on his outfit. Let's say right here in his shorts, center line, and let's add some pockets on the side right here, and a curve. And you can pop them out if you like. And same thing over here.
there. And then um, that is pretty much, oh, except I forgot. I'm just gonna come in here and thicken this top curve just to anchor the eye more. So just thicken the top. There, okay. And then from there, let's draw a part, of course. So right here, if you want to draw the Coco Melon logo, I have a video for that as well, if you want to draw that here. But for me, I'm just going to put a heart right here. So now it's my JJ <laughs> from Coco Melon. There. So I really hope you love how this little boy turned out from um, Coco Melon and that I made it fun and easy for you to follow along with me. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Jurassic Cute videos. See you later.